All right, so uh, we're getting ready for the second stage of detailing the car, getting the most out of the paint. Uh, I've gone back and clay barred over this 1968 uh, MGB again. I've also gotten blue painter's tape out. And as you can see, I've wrapped around the cockpit of the car, the windscreen, every place that has some, um, some type of rubber on it. I do that because I don't want the chemicals of the compounds I'm gonna use to get on there. They're hard to get off. There's products to get it off, but there's no sense if you just take some precautions. Make sure that you use good 3M tape. I also uh, have laid out for us all of the different items that we're gonna be using to do the next few steps. So let me take you through and show you what those are. So, you can see again, we have new microfiber towels. Don't reuse microfiber towels when you're polishing cars. Just spend the money and buy new ones. 3M tape, painter's tape, that won't stick as long. You're gonna want a good quality bug and tar remover. I use turtle wax, and the key to this is not using an aerosol, but rather using a pure liquid. It applies easier, smoother, it doesn't get overspray. Um, uh, so it works better. The other thing is to use a uh, microfiber towel that's a different color than the ones you're using for polishing. That's so you don't throw it down on the ground, pick it up later, try to wipe while you're waxing, polishing, cutting, buffing, and get uh, nasty stuff on it. After we go through those steps of uh, uh, doing it, we're going to get into the cutting, polishing, buffing of the car. We're going to use uh, four different products to do that. We're going to cut the car uh, with, a, with a mirror glaze, that's an ultra high or high uh, grit compound. Then we're going to polish the car with a medium compound. Then we're going to glaze the car with a high level uh, mirror style glaze. After we do that, we're gonna apply a, a Carnuba paste wax to the car, and then we'll use a, a quick mister just to wipe it one, down one time. We'll be doing that with a six inch uh, hand direct or direct function buffer and an 8 inch uh, direct um, drive buffer. So here we go. Well, there you go. About uh, six hours worth of work um, total, about $100 worth of parts or supplies, and um, you can radically change the way a car looks. Uh, Grace is all shined up. Now we got to do the chrome, do some final work on her, and she'll be ready for her new home.